So, this is the last ever episode of the Daily Bread Vlog. And to be honest with you, I'm, I'm at a little bit of a loss of words to even attempt to summarize what has happened over these last 170 episodes, these last eight months of my life. In some ways, it feels like it's gone by like that. But I think in more ways, it's felt like this last eight months has been three or four years uh, of my life. And as I look back at all the videos, kind of reminiscing on, on just all of the content that we've put out over these last eight months, I realized how incredible it is to be able to document your life in this way. And then to be able to take that a step further and put that out for public consumption so that you guys can go on that journey with me. There have been so many different things that we have experienced together in this vlog, uh, from the very first episode all the way up until now, from riding ATVs out in the middle of the desert uh, outside of Vegas, from being on stages in different parts of the country, uh, to talking about real difficult subjects like the struggle with alcohol and, and quitting drinking, um, the different ups and downs that have happened throughout my entire life. And then all the little victories along the way with selling tons of life insurance and documenting that whole process. Um, it really was everything that I hoped it would be and far, far, far more. Um, you guys got to get to know TJ uh, on a personal level um, in his interaction uh, with the vlog and the dynamic between him and I. Sometimes it was funny, we would go to these events and people would want to know more about that, like our relationship, and they would want to know about freaking business or sales or success. But man, um, going into this structure of putting out this level of content on a daily basis, uh, number one, wasn't easy. It wasn't any e easy by any means, but it was so rewarding. It's been so rewarding. It is so rewarding uh, to be able to have that recall and look back at all these different experiences. And for me, being able to just experience them over and over again as I watch these videos and learning new things about myself as I watch them. Uh, I would selfishly tell you that this vlog is for me far more than it is for you. And that 10, 20, 30 years from now, I'll be able to go back and, and watch these episodes and remember uh, the lessons learned and the growth uh, that was a result of all the different things that we were able to accomplish during this time. But now that chapter is over and a new chapter is upon us. And so you're gonna see a lot of changes coming in the content. I'm extremely excited to announce the new vlog. It's called My Living Legacy. And what you will see is a shift in the focus of what my legacy will be for the time that I have remaining on this earth. And that is to truly impact people's lives in a tangible way. To be able to provide a vehicle for them to take their lives to the next level. And it's really, it's the first time in my entire life that my focus is not monetary, that my goals are not transactional, that my vision is now long-term and not short-term. And I think that that's an interesting thing when you have this period of growth like I've had over the last four years. It makes sense to me that when you go from being broke, in debt, and in a bad place, to a certain level of success, a greater level of success, a greater level of success, that in the beginning it would be about that transactional monetary, that all your goals would be about how much money can I bring in and generate. And once 
that process was complete, once full personal responsibility was taken, I am now given the ability to look up, look to my left and right, take a deep breath, and realize what's really important. And that is how many people that I can impact while I'm here. And so my goal moving forward and what we will be documenting on the new vlog called My Living Legacy is to create 25 multimillionaires over the next three years and to create 5,000 six-figure annual earners that aren't just earning six figures, they're winning in all areas of their life. They're winning in their relationships. They're winning with their mind. They're winning with their body. And they're able to create an incredible living and income to support that lifestyle. So that's the focus of what you're gonna be seeing moving forward. And I think it's a um, critical turning point, not just in the content, but in my life. In being able to start seeing long-term and, and start focusing my time, energy, and resources on legacy, on creating an impact, and hopefully on taking you on that journey with me. There are so many people out there. There are so many influencers. There are so many entrepreneurs. There are so many people that are just putting content out there on social media that is based on ideas, that's based on knowledge, that's based on programs and books and masterminds and videos. But what I want this new vlog to document is me providing something tangible, me documenting the actual lives of people that I'm able to impact over these next few years. And for you to see the real results, not the idea of what's possible, the idea of the potential that, that someone can take hold of and, and go out there and hustle and grind and you can do it and keep working, but actually to provide a real vehicle for them to go on that journey in and be able to lock arms with that person and look that person face to face and, and for them to know that I've got their back and that I'm gonna hold them accountable and that I'm gonna take them to where they wanna go. That is the legacy that I know that I was born to live out and this vlog will be the platform that I'm able to show that process. Uh, could not be more excited uh, for this new next chapter and I'm excited for you guys to come along on this journey with me. So with that, this is the last episode of the Daily Bread Vlog. I look forward to seeing you again on the next and new episode of My Living Legacy. <laughs> about building a brand, to learn about how to market like the year that we live in.